There is no reason anymore not to run Windows 10 Pro retail version on your PC. Get it now, $12.50 only, instant delivery on a brand new secured web store. Welcome, welcome to part 41 of this Let's Play Skyrim Special Edition Ultimate Graphics Edition. The 2021 Ultimate Graphics Edition, I should say. Of course, based on the 2021 Ultimate Graphics Tutorial. So if you want to have the same graphics, make sure you check the description, the video description, to find a link to the tutorial and all the mods, etc, etc, etc. You guys probably know it by now after 41 parts. But anyway, welcome again to this uh, part 41. So the last time we ended up here in this uh, crypt with Aila, which did some good job. And I was thinking a little bit why she sometimes don't shoot. And I think that's because I am in combat with uh, enemies. And for that, she probably does not shoot because then she would hit me in the back. So I think that's pretty much what's going on with Aila, which sometimes not look that useful. So yeah, that's something to take uh, to keep in mind. So we are here in this uh, quest. Find out what the vampires are seeking. Hopefully to find Serana here. I'm not sure if we find her already here, but I know this starts the quest line for her. So I hope uh, Serana will be, I'm sorry Ariela, but will be a little bit of a better companion. So we got stuck here last time in this dungeon. We did some, um, some vampire killing already. So that's a good thing. And we were able to do some, um, yeah, good, some good sneak attack shots with the bow. So we uh, sometimes are going level up a bit ourselves with bow and arrow, which is a nice thing. And we're currently using, what kind of arrows are we using actually? Dwarven arrows, we still have some left. That's good and nice. Let's see, we have this frostbite spider here and we have a chest. Not sure if it is trapped in some way. It looks like it, like it. No, it's not. Okay. Then let's continue further to see what we will find. We'll find this gate here, it seems. Okay. I would say let's... Uh... Oh, Ayla, really? Why are you doing that? Spellcasters don't really like uh, being uh, blocked all the time. So, a vampire, master vampire here, which killed this huge spider. And also, by the way, uh, for the ones who haven't tuned in lately, the parts have been increased to at least 45 minutes. So, uh, because I find that 20 and even 30 minutes weren't really good enough to finish the quest. So, yeah. You know, it's... Um, I think these things can become... Not this one. It can't come alive, right? The gargoyles. So, let's see what we'll find here. I'll never tell you anything, vampire. Both to stand on, stronger than any suffering you can inflict on me. I believe you, Richard, and I don't think you even know what you found. Wow! Look at this. What's this? Okay. So, this is a nice location, isn't it? You don't see that every day. Where are you? It's gone now. Hmm, seems there are some um, vampires here, which we need to be careful a little bit. Yes. to cheese you to death since you're now uh, behind this bar. Oh. 
Are <laughs> you sure you're, uh, yeah, thanks, Ayla. I had some confidence in her that she was able to, um, shoot her for point blank. And, uh, Ayla did not, uh, disappoint me. But, uh, yeah, so there were two of these vampires here. I really don't like these gargoyles, but uh, anyway, there's definitely something here. This is one of our, yeah, friends from the uh, Vampire Hunters, I think. Make sure we're going to read everything, by the way. Because I also have, always have a lot of papers and books and stuff, you know, and for some reason uh, I always forget to read them. Make sure we're going to do that. What is a res resist potion recipe? Thistle and Falmer ears. Okay. Oh, we learned Mage Light. Well, it's, to be honest, not really a bad spell. Oh, look at that. Is that a vampire? Probably is, right? Question is can we hit it? Yes, we can. That was so close. That was not. And we are level up. Isn't that nice? Cool. So we can... Let's pick... What shall we do? Stamina health. Let's pick stamina. And we can increase a point. <clears throat> so let's see. What can we... Is there anything we can actually increase? Half damage. Okay. Nah, I don't think that's really that useful. Let's see, we have one-handed skill of 75, so we are pretty close in the good stuff, I think. Um, Bladesman. So can we get to the street, please? Mm, okay, it's not really gonna work. Um, yeah, this requires uh, a lot more skill. So also not that. Then we can either go with archery or go with something else. Um, yeah, that's a good question. Block, is there anything we can do with our um, skill 56? Nah, we need more block skill. Now maybe we can um, put a point in archery then. Yep, 60% more damage, so it's useful now to actually, you know, shoot uh, from range. So this might be the place with Serana. But I'm not super sure about this. Oh, oh boy, that's not good now, is it? Let me uh, silence my phone. Okay. So what's going on here? Um, we have the skelly here. More importantly, what is this button? Okay. So what does the quest say to us? Find out what the vampires are seeking. Yeah, okay, but... Ah, okay. There is something here. Hmm. Oh yeah, what I wanted to do was to go for the mage lights. Yeah, that's pretty nice spell I think to cost. Yes. So let's see, uh, how is this gonna work? Um, do the braziers need to be in the inner circle or something? Ok, 
Okay, let's uh, put some effort in this. So what we do we need to do is we need to place the blazers in such a way that they're actually doing something. Ah, okay, we need to like lit these rings it seems. Okay, we can do that. Okay. Oh, we can't actually push this one, so... Hmm, okay, let me see. So, what's going on with these braziers? This, this circle is um, fully costed. What's wrong with this one? Or do they have to be, like, connected? to be really honest. Okay, so that one's lit. Okay, we are getting closer. Or are we already here? It seems like it. Holy. Moly. So, how do we get to the button? Oh, here she is, actually. Serana. I could really remember this, but this is definitely the artifact. Where is... who sent you here? I don't know who that is. Is he... like me? Oh, but... Can't you tell just from looking at me? A vampire. I guess so. Uh, nope. <laughs> Let's uh, dodge the question a little bit. That's complicated. And I'm not totally sure if I can trust you. But if you want to know the whole story, help me get back to my family's home. Mm, okay. If my family used to live on an island to the west of Solitude, I would guess they still do. By the way, my name is Serana. Yeah, let's uh, finish this quest. Um, Your guess is as good as mine. This place looks pretty different from when I was locked away. I'd rather not get into that with you, if that's all right. I'm sorry. It's not that. Let's get to my home, and I'll have a better sense. Of... Good question. Hard to say. I, I can't really tell. Probably pretty long, I would say. I feel like it was a long time. Who is Skyrim's High King? <laughs> yeah, it's actually a matter for debate. Um, oh, wonderful. A war of succession. Good to know the world didn't... Since I didn't pick a side yet, right? I mean... Who are the contenders? Empire? What... What empire? Cyrodiil is the seat of an empire? I must have been gone longer than I thought. Definitely longer than we planned. Please, let's hurry. I need to get home so I can figure out what's happened. All right, all right, all right. It's on an island near Solitude. Hopefully, we can find a boat to take us there. Yeah, that looks like an Elder it's Scroll, by the way, home. but I don't know really the, the story about it. Place, and I didn't really want to uh, want to spoil it for you guys, but it is a dialogue option, so yeah. Let's just say that my mother and father had a bit of a falling out. Don't worry, I'm not in any danger or anything like that. It'll just be more. Yes, it is. It's, <laughs> it's just another. Okay. It's complicated. I can't she just has an elder school, just like that, you know. That's kind of insane. Yes, it is. And it's. I want to have the other option. So, is it fragile? Do we need to be careful with it? <laughs> Nothing can destroy an elder scroll. Worry more about protecting your hide, and let me worry about my things. Okay. Um... What can I do for you, friend? I need to. What do you need? Trade some things, be else it might be gone. So let's um, take everything, pretty much, <laughs> I would say. She can keep the Thieves Guild armor, maybe? Or not? Nah. So, um, let's, I'm still here. let's just give her a bow. What do you need to take? 
Uh, let's see. <clears throat> so she can have this orcish bow, she like. And some iron arrows, sure. Because I'm not sure if she's actually let's going go. to... Oh shit, where is Serana? Where is Serana? Oh, what is it? <clears throat> okay, so we have two followers then. I guess. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be like that, but... Not going to happen. Oh, what? Really? <sighs> okay, Ayla, I have to come back to you with my tail between my legs, so... What do you need? I need to dump, like, pretty much everything again. Oh, boy. Okay, so... Let's drop all this stuff again. So, I'm pretty much over encumbered a lot, I guess. Um, Dungard War X, Dwarven Dagger, an Ebony Sword, an Orcus Dagger, Orcus Mace, the Steel Crossbow, the Steel Sword of Arking, the Wabba Jack, you can also have that one, the Steel Bolts. Yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. Okay, so I have some breeding space again. Let's go. Okay, so I guess they both are now in my party then, I guess. Look at her eyes, by the way. She has this uh, cat-like eyes. And that's the way, uh, if you follow the tutorial, you know, we have the option to select which eyes she had. But I think this yellow eyes pretty much matches her um, vampire posture a little bit better than uh, humanish, uh, humanish eyes. So, okay, so we have Serana. Um, as far as I know, at our site, so she's going to be a spellcaster, I think. Let's say, um, yeah, let's see um, we're going to find out. By the way, the mage light is very cool for showing people's faces, as you can see. They really have this very nice, somewhat natural, cavish light, which is uh, nice. Um, but I think we're going to be attacked by gargoyles or something. Question is, how do we get out of here? Um, so let's see, what does the quest lock say to us? Lead Savannah to her home, yeah, fantastic. That means we need to find a way out of here. Um, okay, so that's not this way. Mind yourself. I think we need to go that way. I'm not sure which way we came from, actually. But I think these gargoyles are going to be pretty hostile. Don't you guys think? Or not. Hmm. Oh, they are. <laughs> we are better fighters. To heal ourselves then. Hmm, okay, so that was pretty lame. I already shot at them, but apparently in stone form they are like immune. So okay. They have some nice stuff. So this is one gargoyle. Here is um ingredients and there's the other one. Ah, that's nice that we actually do have two um companions, so if you guys don't mind that much, I'm going to keep Aela if she's not going to leave our side. Because two ranged characters are pretty nice. But then again, yeah, I don't think it's that overpowered since Aela can't really shoot a lot of times, you know. She just um Usually I'm I'm in the way, especially when fighting um, a monster 1v1. And then she's unable to shoot, so. I'm not sure. What do you guys think in the comments? Is it a bit lame to have two characters? Or shall I just keep only Serana? Let me know what you guys think. Let me know that in the comments, please. So, let's see if we're able to get out of here. Don't worry, Serana. We are uh, hopefully getting out of here pretty soon. So, undeads, or what is going to attack us here? Blister work. They can be used for creating healing potions, if I'm not mistaken. Let's 
So, which way do we need to get out of here? Okay. Healing potions. Love that. Looks like the wall for a uh, dragon shot, by the way. Hmm. Um, there is no... No lever here? That's unfortunate. Okay. Oh, that's what it is then. It means we probably need to fight undead again. And they're probably going to be spawned when we pull a lever. Yeah. Brace yourself, and that are coming. Can't be pretty sure about that. So I do have unrelenting force enabled. Yep. Come out and play. Oh, she can actually. Uh, Reanimate to undead. <laughs> this is pretty funny, but also pretty terrifying. Okay, so hey, they're a good team so far. They are maybe a bit strong, but we're going to find it out. We still have some way to go to uh, Saran's uh, castle where the family lives. So let's find it out. Let's see. I can hear skeletons. So. Where are they? That's a throne, I think. Oh, there is one over there. Yeah, that was a nice hit. If I may say so myself. Is someone there? So Overlord. Okay, let's be careful. We can dance all day, but maybe if we can like steer them towards us, we can um, give uh, Ayla an opportunity to uh, shoot at them. Ourselves. Let's go melee again. Let's not focus that much on uh, bow and arrow. Since we we're originally a shield and one handed sword guy, if you can remember. We have some dead bell here. I do hear skeletons. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there is the one from Serana. It's also pretty cool if we can keep Serana because she can like reanimate these undead. And we have some tanky character with us as well so um, it might be a little bit too overpowered having two characters but then again it's fun to have a party of um, of people here let's see what do we have here treasure chest with a glass sword nice look at that a glass war hammer wow what is this increases magic resistance by 12 holy moly is that any good? No, my orcish shield is way, way better. So we need to uh, give something to um, Ayla. What can I do for you, friend? I need to trade what some things need? with you, please. And that is a lot of heavy weapons. Uh, that includes this glass sword, glass war armor, the orcish mace. 
We should keep moving. Hey, is this not a shark? Stamina drain, vitality, nice. Let's uh, well, you know what I'm going to do? There is some um, copyright music, but I can't really work without not having any music at all. So I hope the ambient sounds will override the music. Okay, cool. We have escaped, so let's um, let's go to our home, the castle, to see what we'll find out there. To breathe again. Cool. Even in this moment, it's better than the cave. So now we're able to see Serana's face. It's not too far now. Yeah, you can see her fangs definitely. Yes. You know, she's a true vampire. But yeah, we have a party, which is pretty um, weird for me actually playing Skyrim that you do have a party of two adventurers. Let's see, there is something over there, campfire. Did we already check that out? I can't remember that there was this crypt here nearby where we also need to uh, do something. I would say let's discover it since there was this quest to um, retrieve something, if I'm not mistaken. Where is this? Yeah, find immune amulet. So let's do that. We, since we now have this party. But first I check out what this is actually. Since I have no idea. Oh wow, look at this. Just randomly laying here, it's... Is this Skyrim Vanilla? Do you guys know that? these fine clothes man it's just a waste not to take these with us leather strips now pelts let's see if we can use any of these things to um, increase some skills yeah we can create leather you know, but um, yeah why not Someone is using it. Oh, it is. What is that, Serana? Okay. <laughs> we can upgrade our pickaxe. Sure, why not? Serana's uh, is wearing a hood now, by the way. That's unfortunate. Uh, I loved the hair from um, from the player model, from the. Um, what is it from the uh, model from the jeans from the same author? So I might want to. Hey, wow! Steel grid sort of frost. Look at this stuff. Just random stuff laying around. Yeah, just an elven light armor. Wow! What is this? Seriously. Just magic weapons. I'm uh, having uh, finding the jackpot here, really. I might want to. Um, Want to give her the light armor, Aila, I mean, with her. It's also just some potions, some pretty good stuff, really. It's just laying here, like, uh, for the taking. This gold terrain, this gold emerald terrain, with some insane value. Wow, it's. Or, wow, look at this. Holy moly, just the orcish armor laying here? Seriously, what is this place? I have really no idea. Do you guys know if this is in the um, in the base game? Or is this a mod? Wow, I'm really super surprised actually. So we have this two-handed axe, but we don't have much skill. Or is this a one-handed? Now it's a two-handed axe, right? Yeah. We don't have much experience in two-handed weapons, so that's unfortunate. Hey, let's see. Maybe we can uh, smell something. 
iron ingots. Sure. And let's see if we can create something on the workbenches. Or maybe upgrade some other. Hey, wow. I completely missed this stuff. It's absolutely really insane, this iron. <laughs> I'm really surprised to find this stuff here all of a sudden. What is this? Steel plates? Sure, let's just pick everything. Let's take everything with us. Here are just some Orcus bars. Wow, man, I'm super, super um, surprised to be really honest. Let's see what we can do. Um, yeah, we can craft all this Orcus stuff. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I mean, sure. And maybe, um, yeah. Okay, let's do that. An Orcus bow. Imperial bows. Yep, sure. So we use the anvil, the workbench. Let's see if we can improve something. Yep, we can improve elven stuff. Superior elven. Okay. Well, let's, in that case, um, give her the elven armor. I'm not sure if uh, Ayla wants to... Because it is a very good light armor. I think, to be honest, it's better than the um, Thieves' Guild armor she's now wearing. What can I do for you, friend? So, I'll be sure to put it to let's uh, give her a huge pile of crap. And then let's see um, what she wants to uh, wear. No, she's not going to wear the elven stuff, it seems. But anyway, we need to drop a lot of stuff at her. Including the... Oh, she is actually carrying it. Um, I'm not sure if she's going to wear the orcish armor. I don't think that's a very good idea since she's an archer. But anyway, it doesn't matter that much. Okay, what's going on? Oh, she is actually... Overweight. Is there anything else you need? As in, she can't carry anything anymore. Let's go. What about oh, you? What is it? I think I'll hang on to my things. Thank you. What can I help you with today? Okay. What do you need? Oh man. There's also no shop here or something, right? Oh man, that's uh, keep that's very unfortunate. Um that means we're going to need to drop a lot of things. And that's very unfortunate, <laughs> really it is. Oh boy, so what do we need to drop then? Probably Yeah. I really don't want to drop anything. Is there no shop here? Buy or something? Or can we not like store it maybe somewhere? Crap. We have this can we like fast travel? Nah, you cannot fast travel while over encumbered. Man, that's so bad. That's so unfortunate. So I have an idea. I'm not sure if this is gonna work, but I'm going to try it anyway. Let's try to store this stuff in a barrel. And um, yeah, let's see. Um, you Serana, why don't you I'm just want to here. trade stuff with to us? Take? So uh, let's see, what is some very, very nice stuff? She's wearing Orcus armor, it seems. I don't want her to wear that. So maybe we can store the Orcus stuff in uh, this barrel as well. Lead on then. Let's get indoors. Or in a and I hope, I'm not sure if this is going to work, but I hope we were able to store it in this nice. container. And I definitely want to create a new save for this. Um, because it's very, very valuable. Let's see. So, um, let's quick save and let's... How am I supposed to do that again? Just save? Yeah, new save. Okay. And just drop a lot of stuff in a barrel. Unfortunately, there's no other way to do this. So, yeah. I hope we were able to find them, these items again when we uh, when we come back. Oh, we can't drop weather control stuff. So, uh, what do we want to keep? We want to keep the ebony bow. We want to, yeah, I think drop this heavy stuff.
okay that's uh, going to do it for now so let's see we need to go to here to find the moon amulets where is that then that's right here in the frostmer crypt so find the moon amulet inside the frostmer crypt so let's see which uh quest is actually doing this yeah it's something from the optional quests that means we can like disable everything except for the miscellaneous quest which are now also a lot active but hey we have some um, some place to go so um, what I suggest we're going to do is we're going to add a map marker here so how do we do that again Uh, poo. Let's see. Um, how do we set a map marker again? Normally, I always like accidentally do this, but not like this. Let me quickly search for it. Setting map markers on Skyrim. What a preparation, guys! That I have to like do this while in comment, uh, while in game. Um, let's see. Set map marker. Skyrim. Click on a map in empty area should give you three options. One is to remove it. Uh, okay. Oh man. So. <laughs> Apparently, have to remove the old one or something. Custom destination. So, okay, let's <laughs> let's go to mouse and keyboard. I think that works a lot. Um, it looks it works a lot better. I mean, why can I not like? How do I set a custom destination? How do we do that, guys? Really, seriously. <sighs> Screw this. I'm going to create a screenshot of this. Or a, um, a picture in my phone, actually. That's what I'm going to do. This is how desperate or I am not finding the solution but okay I'm going to switch back to the controller I do it know this location let's uh, continue on our adventure let's go to the um, place of the script in the cup oh what's going on what are you are you hostile or oh hello there I did notice you come up I was focusing my magic on Okay. Or at least I thought I was. I don't really know what I'm doing. I used to think so, too. See, my grandfather was a wizard. My father wouldn't talk about him much. But I found some of his things in the attic, including this staff. Mm -hmm. After that, I thought I was turning into a wizard, too. Because dead things near oh, me... Oh, it's necromancy stuff. I even went to the College of Winterhold. They just laughed at me. The magic is in the staff, not in me, they said. <laughs> okay, okay, you've talked me into it. In fact, keep it. I must have used up the magic in the staff or something. It's just the dumbest. Okay, so what is this then? Um, oh, wow, okay. I would now. Sorry, buddy, but uh, can't leave any survivors. That was really mean, wasn't it? <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't do that. I've done that. You're not getting the best of me. Speaking about mean things, killing random foxes, but uh, hey. Okay, so we are getting into the script. So I, since it is a side quest, I don't think it's a very long side quest. Um, by the way, we 
we uh, spent the entire night in the uh, dungeon where we found Serana. Let's uh, equip our bow. It's not gonna work with controller aim, and I'm really wasting my dwarven arrows here, by the way. So let's see, how far do we still need to go? Oh, we already passed it, actually. Okay. So, it's always so, and I'm so bad with these quest markers, you know? Um, so where is it? It is here, right? So why can I not see it then? Here somewhere. Yeah, <sighs> what the hell? So we need to go to the blue arrow. Why can we not find this? Is it like birds in the ground? Something like that? Yeah, it is. Uh, that sucks. So, okay, that means we need to try to find it somewhere in the mountain. Let's see, how long do we have left in our timer? Okay, like four minutes or something, so... So, where is this freaking dungeon now? I have no idea, really. I don't. Um, quests. So, what do we need to do? Let's see. Not this one, not this one, not this one, not this one. This one, I guess. It's Moon Amulet. Am I just that stupid that I can't find the entrance of the freaking crypt? Or, or what? Okay, so here it is somewhere. Okay, I guess here it is then. Ah, okay, we're getting there somewhere. Let's uh, be careful since it's quite a long drop. But since we are a uh, character in Skyrim, we sure can use our magic. What is this? Is he hostile? What do you guys think? Oh shit, that was maybe not a good idea to do. Okay, let's uh, quick load that. I don't think that was the meaning of that. Um, crap, this is the latest safe. Okay, sure. Let's not do that. Seems like a plot character, so... I don't think that's a good idea to do that. Ah, oh, fuck. Sorry. Pardon my French, but I have to... Not going to do that. This quick save was right after I did store everything, right? Why is this barrel empty? Seriously. I did I not store everything in here? It's so annoying. I mean, I did store everything in here, right? Why is it then all of a sudden back? Okay, let's try it again. this work of shields okay so what we want to do is save new save and quick save thank you very much and then when it comes to quests we want to disable everything except for the one quest that we need to retrieve that stupid what is it Moon Amulet, yeah, that's the one I want. Hey, and now I can maybe, like, improve my life since the mage is there. I mean, don't need to kill him, so I can be a good guy again. And why do I not have my 
Oh. This one? The shield? Oh, hello there. Did yeah, you notice yeah, give me you come up? I was focusing my magicka. Or at least I thought I was. I don't really know what I'm doing. Mm hmm well, I used to... See, my... After that, yeah, I... Yeah, yeah, okay. I give me the stuff. The give me the stuff. Okay, <laughs> okay. Look at the position of Serana. She's like... In fact, keep it. I'm going to Unless slit his throat. The magic and the staff. So, I'm going to say, let's first go to the... Um, the crypt before we're going to end this part because we wasted a lot of time at those items really and i would say when we can maybe control serana maybe we can like um give her all the items from that barrel and then we can sell everything or see what's useful you know and uh, maybe you can decide if you're going to ditch one of the two later. But for now, I'm going to keep both. I think that's pretty nice. To have two characters at our side. But of course, eventually it's going to be pretty overpowered. Because I know a lot of you guys are not even using any follower at all. Oh, okay. So there are hostiles here, it seems. Who in Dagon's name are you? Speak, or I'll cut you down where you stand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> let's let's just see, man. Huh. Suit yourself. You're mine. <laughs> Easily blocked. <laughs> Always pressing my left thumbstick in, which is kind of annoying. So you can go, you go into stealth. Oh shit, that's not what I want to do. Um. I also want the extra. Nah, let's go with the plentiful stamina. Why am I pressing the freaking? Left thumbstick all the time. Sorry, at least a black turn, but I can't share any treasures. So let's see, at least it's journal. Let's help with her. Hey, she started a little bit by intimidating me. The pill lady, okay. Oh wow, you're uh, uh, fashionably late to the party. But okay, 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 okay. We're going to um, get in. Let's see what we're gonna find out here. Guess this is what we're gonna do, guys. So yeah, I hope you guys liked this part. Um, it was a little bit of a messy part, sorry about that. But um, hopefully we will find some nice stuff here in the tomb in the next part. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Take care and bye-bye.